Y'all, Byron is taking big advantage of this Chick-fil-A breakfast before he can't have it anymore. Well, not that he can't have it anymore. Him and Sparks would just have to take like a 30 minute journey before we get to breakfast. Mm -hmm. And alright, Mama. I don't think it's actually 30 minutes. You want to go on the journey? It's, it's, it's close. It's, it's a long journey. Minutes, so. Okay. Well, based when we get back, my food will be eaten, and as far as why I've eaten your food. Right, Mama? Hey, guys. Byron just took the puzzle to put it in the car because it's easier to move when we don't have anything in there. Went ahead and took a Zyrtex. As you guys can tell, I'm in a tank top. Yeah. It's going to be 72, I think, is Shamamish today. We don't have anything to take at the apartment. You guys remember the other weekend I had to chew it with the burger and ugh. Yesterday it was 82 in Port Charlotte though, so I will take the 72. Y'all, my unread bookshelves are all empty. It's a sad, sad day. All my bookshelves are empty. Oh, my husband's here. Yeah. All my bookshelves are empty though. I know. Look, all my red bookshelves empty. One over there is empty. Honest opinion, what do you think of the new Insig song? I actually wasn't paying attention. No, I'm sorry. No, it was really good. It I was really it. good. It was really good. You know what's not really good? The traffic. Oh my god, yeah, there's so much traffic on the way to Trinidad. Yes, it's a traffic day. Apparently, it's very nice and sunny out, so everybody decided, you know what? Let's get out the house. Oh, yeah, that's a lot of bumper that, that is a lot of bumper stickers. But no, I liked it. It was a really. It was good really good. Very it was nice. really. I so I had heard that they were gonna be on Justin's new CD on a song, but I thought it was like a backup vocal then my friend sarah wrote me and she's like no it's like a whole song and she's like it's called paradise so i went to spotify i looked it up so good although i told sarah this too i was like i don't know how i feel about you telling me about classic instinct songs so i said it sounds like their old vibe because she was the backstreet boy fan and i was the instinct fan so we got a laugh out of it but really good go check it out paradise so we have to get off an exit because apparently the highway's closed down right here. I think it said it was an accident up there, but I don't know. Yeah, it like can't. It's a really big accident. Yeah. I've never seen them close off all lanes. Yeah, that's crazy. Hopefully everyone's okay that was in it. So it's like in traffic, and we're going to be in traffic for a while. Like, it's red for like the next, like, ever <laughs> and ever and ever. And you can see yeah. the highway up there, and it's still trafficy up there. Ew. Yeah, then a couple oh. cars turned around already and said just they gave up. Which I was like, some people, because this is probably like the back road if you don't want to go on the highway. And I'm like, some people probably do like other normal thing. Like, what's going on? Why mm. is there so much traffic? This guy, like two cars ahead of us, has like just trees and flowers in the back of his truck. And we've been following him the whole time. We're in traffic cameras, I'm focusing. Y'all, this is my favorite Usher song. I love this song. Right? Best album song? Put them on Ever. My way was good. My way is really good. It was weird. We're finally seeing a little bit of blue on the map, guys. Still following this man, but it looked like his plant fell down. Wind took it out. I still haven't turned, I figured out how to turn the heat off. So I pushed it in and it went all the way down to like 49. So that's not how you do it. We came on Wednesday, as you guys know, when we were supposed to be in Portland, seeing Thibel and Patty, but the damn hawks. So we came, and we got a lot of work done. Got the couch, half put together. Um, there's still two more sides, which are over there. We realized we are going to have to move it when the movers come, because there's going to be a bookshelf back there, and my desk has to go beside behind this side. So we stopped and we made it just like this so that we could sit on it while we're here. And bookshelves get in and stuff, we could just add the ends on. It is so easy to move. It is so nice. It is so comfortable. We got my Thibault jersey hung up. This is the jersey that uh, my brother got me for Christmas like two years ago. That's also up there, the Patty jersey. It's not the same type of jersey that I'm doing for my Australian wall, so that's why that Patty jersey is not over there. We also hung up our barn, but the greatest wall of all we added the lights and we got the um, puzzles and the jerseys up. Oh, why is that up? <laughs> Who did this? Who broke into here? Whatever. In Australia. <laughs> Although I did notice that the orange, the gold lights do overpower the green a little bit, but I love it. It looks so good. It's so nice. It's coming together. Looks like the puzzle made it here in one piece. Byron taped the drawers shut, which I didn't even think about, so I'm glad he did that. Oh my that. goodness, yeah, I almost didn't, and I was like, oh, I can see me like 
slide the puzzle. God, yes, yeah, just all over the place. <laughs> Let me tell you about this glory that is this couch. We don't want to dive on it, right? No, we are not flopping or diving in couches because husband likes to do that. <laughs> and then we have to get new couches. Yes. Oh my God, I love this couch. I miss this couch so much when I'm on that other couch back in the house. Mm. It's so nice. Go see. Now if I just had a blanket, oh my God, it'd be so like, we are going to measure the blinds while we're here because these three need blinds. I'm probably going to open that for smuggers though because they've been chilling with it at the house open and they've loved it. I figured out that his level magnetic, but I can't pick it up, so I don't think it really is. I think Byron lied to me. Oh, this side is. Ha ha ha. One side is I went fishing and I got it. You're a mess. Yeah. Uh, home improvement stuff does not get done with Sarah. Why are we leaving the house? It doesn't. Oh. Robbers. No, that was from, <laughs> that was from the common room. The common room's theme is green and gold. No, that's not the common room theme. I told Byron we should have got green and gold for these three windows and it could have matched. Well, we got blue and it matches the flag. Oh. So there you go. Oh. Common room themed bet. Done. If you guys remember the Port Charlotte blinds before the curtain, Byron kept hanging like rods in the wall like the metal rods we hit one here but luckily it didn't like go the all the way over it's like the window uh frame mm. so that, i always forget about those yeah so luckily he was able to get it in but we're thinking we might just get another like middle thing and just connect it yeah i'm gonna need the blinds behind my chair totally. even though my chair's here i don't want him to jump in my chair and then be like row, 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 row. Okay. did you like my smokers impression now you can tell where the heat's on, where the heat's off. It is freezing right over here. I have my Beauty and the Beast up. Yeah, that's our new man right there. You're such a mess. And the Beast is no longer. <laughs> You're such a mess. I bought that for Byron one Valentine's Day in Florida, but it's next to Gaston. So do I move Gaston and Lumineer and switch them? Because Lumineer should actually be in our Clogsworth, right? Right. Absolutely. Right, and Clogsworth next to me because I love Clogsworth. I don't know why. I, I don't mind being a fan of Clogsworth in the movie. But he always has the coolest merchandise. Oh look, Beauty and the Beast are here. Also added our winter scenes. Which by the way, y'all, we got this at Goodwill in Florida for two dollars. And that thing is a beautiful. Like uh, it Goodwill? Yeah, it says that on the back. And I remember when we found it at the Port Charlotte one. That one we got in Blue Ridge. Hung up New York and Seattle. That's about the work we did today, and it's really coming together. Like, it looks really good. It does look good. I'm going to show Byron real quick. I don't think he's seen the magnitude of all the hash browns he's bought me. Oh, my goodness, yes. Let me see this. Oh, my God. <laughs> I saw a glimpse, and I'm already like... <laughs> look, I have a nice little water collection started, too, here. <laughs> that's that's way too many. Okay, we're done. No! That's way too many. Papa, forever! Okay, it's not forever. Until we find out if the Marketplace has it. Because if the Marketplace has it... Then like like once like once a month maybe once a week once every other week we can take a trip there they just don't do delivery so next weekend will be the last weekend before we move. Wow. Okay, so we're at the storage place. I told Byron when we came here on Wednesday that it was like the first time I've been in an elevator mm -hmm. since we like returned his camera after yeah. the eclipse. Yeah. Yes. No. Did I get a bloody nose? Or something when we were there. Remember I had to go to the bathroom. I was bleeding yeah, or something happened. She's so cold up here. Yeah, it is freezing. Can you go in front of me? I'm going to go down that dark hallway. Oh my god. Thank you. Oh my god, this is creepy. It's cold. It is so cold. Oh, it turns on. Yeah, it turns on well before you get there, but it's still creepy. I think this used to be a public storage place. Like the one that was owned by U-Haul. Because this looks just like it. Yeah, I pushed it, and yeah, Byron almost got caught in the corner, so <laughs> he said he'll pull it. My nose is so cold right now. We have to get that. Well, we have to get downstairs to leave, but we also have to get downstairs because we're supposed to call my nephew at 3.30, and it's 3.30 right now. If we keep getting lost, we'll just call him from the storage unit. Like, hey, happy 18th birthday. We're in the storage unit. It's cold. <laughs> oh, my God, y'all missed it. This door half open. Mm -hmm. And then start closing. And then start closing. And then Byron's like, let's get on it. Well, birthday hey, boy. Hey, birthday boy. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, man. Thank you. It's, it's, it's the big mob. Big so. 18. Yeah. 
<laughs> like, it don't feel no different. Oh, yeah, it's all right. I can get a tattoo now, though. Yeah, you can. That is true. Oh, my God, that's a spider. Where? On oh, the car. Anyway. Today would have been our sixth anniversary of living in Florida. I think there's some Arby's. Because Byron City doesn't think there's an Arby's where we're, like, near where we're going. Thought it was not playing today, though. Uh, sore. Uh, knee? Leg? Something. It's okay because we need to keep all of our Australians safe before the Olympics. We were watching OKC play the Mavs the other day. Green went down. He sprained his ankle, but a lot of people were talking about it might be his Achilles at first. So that made me a little like nervous. Exum went down like the next quarter, mm -hmm. but he came back. His was just like a little bit of like pain, but he has bad knees or ankles. You gotta shoot it. All right, New Orleans, get your clock better. Aiden thought they had the full clock again. Mm. So he thought he had till the end of the quarter. He didn't know that you only had 1.7 seconds. Well, if they didn't mess up and freeze the clock the first time, we could have just got Kamara's awesome basket, but whatever. Yeah, firecracker. I love Alvarado. I do like him. I mean, he has a great attitude. I remember that from the All-Star game last year, but he's just like, he's everywhere. He, he's a firecracker. That's what we call him. That is the ugliest score I've ever seen. So right now, the Trailblazers are down by 10 because Jabari Walker just got a three-pointer. They're actually doing really well against the Pelicans, who are in like fifth, I think, minus Dyson, who's out with... Something wrong with his knee, which hopefully heals before Paris. I said you're a good boy. So about to fight Byron. I don't know why he wants to fight when I say he's a good boy. For he's fun. Like, no, I'm not. I'm <laughs> don't rabbit. say that about me. Yeah. The trouble is ended up losing, but we got to see Dyson and Reef. I didn't see Thibel the whole game. And I didn't see him at the end of the game in the Australian circle with Dyson and Reef, so... I think this is payback for Byron taking my phone. He has to play the intro again for Disney Blitz. Like five minutes, it, it, it does take a while. They do change phones every so often. So. Doing Disney Blitz emojis asked me if I want to use the save game for this device, which is two emojis, mission level four and 10 gems, or the server, which is 376 emojis. Mission level 384 in 3,891 days. Be the first one. The first one? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I like how he ran to your office and the cat learned to go around the front of the house. Apparently the boys are very upset because there's an orange cat on the other side of the fence. I remember the last time I had a McDonald's smoothie. Now we're about to watch the best Oh. Mm, no, we're not watching the best show ever. Mm, tell them about the best show ever. Best show ever is Fire Country. Mm -hmm. If you've not seen it, oh my god, it's so good. We don't get a new one until April 5th, though, which makes me kind of sad. Fire Country, they don't need any more supporters there to get a third season, and I'm controlled, though. They change my background. Oh, this one's still cute. It's still the same four guys and Tati. But I do like these bubble numbers. So this phone has one good thing going for it right now. Oh! Oh, cute. That is going to break my heart. We love you, Nevada. You are a good, a good first horse. Thank you for giving us two babies. And we're gonna be. Was she looking at me? <laughs> That's hilarious. Yeah, bust for some tips. They get yeah. some money before you. Well, go. Like, oh, it's open mic night, and um, yeah, so we're gonna have her do her thing here. <laughs> Who are you saying is bad? But I mean, my daughter's neighborhood fight night. She said the mic with her. That was weird. That was hilarious. Yeah, look at her. I can't see, honey. You're, you're kind of in my way. Yeah, she really is. Y'all, Christina is our first to age out. Y'all, Julia is one of a kind. She's supposed to be making friends, but instead she went and bought herself a chilled sage green tea. All right, you do you, girl. Guys, I hope everyone had a good Saturday. Hope everyone has a good rest of their weekend. We'll see you guys tomorrow.